and welcome back to Sisters United. You are joined by player one and player two. And welcome to our Not To Be Challenge with Little Skyberry and all of his children. Yes, all of them. So in the last episode, it was a bit of a slow one because we were just kind of getting through Christmas and everything. But this episode, we've got goals. Yes, we do. So Sky needs to get his, um, what's it? Charisma up. Yep, he does. To, he needs to complete his charisma. We want to try and get him to complete his logic skill and get a promotion, or at least leave off ready for a promotion because he's got the weekend. Yeah, he has the weekend to get all these. Little Garnet has done everything she needs, and her birthday is tomorrow. Yes, it is. And we are going to work on her brothers and sisters' aspirations, but they are a priority. They're so not. they, if they don't get done, they don't get done. But we will try and make sure they get done. Yeah. So little. So to help him along, we're going to allow him oh, to be inspired, inspired, and uh, draw the two pictures that he needs to do. While well inspired, draw people and draw a vehicle and then she is doing her keyboard that her mum managed to find for her and then she needs to draw all five tip picture types so she she's nearly done and Krim got finished because we decided to cheat just a smidge and say because she's friends with her brothers and sisters and technically this babysitter or her mum she met me. Yeah, she did. So I think once we get to a little bit later on in the afternoon, we're going to send the five children outside to play. Yeah, and once it dries up. the toddlers can just chill in the house. Because this babysitter we gave some CC up, it, he's actually nice and he will stay. Yeah. And I feel like where possible, he does help Sky out for free. Ah, yeah, because. He could see how much Sky is struggling. You know, he's been there since, you know, all of them, not all of them, but four of them were toddlers. Yeah, and he's trying, you know, to get on in his career. So I am just going to form a group so that the children are ready to go outside and play. Yes. So also, Sky stole this yep. from work. He did. And what we are going to do is, after he goes on his two blind dates, one of them's going to invite him back to their place and he'll steal something from their house. Yeah, because you know he's stolen in a while. In a while. And he doesn't really want to go over to Todd's because Todd has been having a lot of arguments with a lady. A pregnant lady. Yes, but he may go visit because he'll want to know who this lady is. And maybe steal some more stuff. Yes, and steal some more stuff. So achieve level five creativity and play with free toys. So you can do the dishes. Oh, it looks like the washing might need done as well. You can dry the laundry. And you can. Oh well, we can't do anything till that laundry's dry. Mom's baby, so let's do it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I have no idea where their toys are, so I'm gonna buy them a toy box because they all had a special toy. I from their dad. Yeah. Where did you get that? <laughs> I don't know. But he's gone. <laughs> I can hear Jonathan. What's he doing? What's Jonathan doing? I don't know anything. It's so nice. It's time to turn the TV off. Why don't you play with your little wolf? Would you? Where did you put your wolf now? You never know. Toss it at your arse. Just go play with it. I think it's time. That Sky reaches out to his siblings to possibly, you know, get a babysitter. Well, what we're going to do is call one over as a babysitter, but story wise, he's not. He's inviting them over and yes. they suggest he go out. Yes. So, 
right, let's have a look. So they will encourage them to go out, not necessarily, you know, to go into a loving relationship, just to go out and mingle and have fun. Yeah, because he, in a way, came out of a serious relationship. Well, he's been single for, I would say, I know in Sim World it's not that long, but if we were trying to make it, it, it would be about at least three to four years. Yeah. Because they, well, I would say three years, because they are like, half quite skilled now in their toddlerhood so they'd be about three to four years old yeah preschool age anyway so yeah. you know it's been four years and you are obsessed with the tv I love the TV. maybe you want to be a movie star or something i don't know i'm gonna be the first wolf movie star <laughs> well, okay so he's reached He's reached level nine. I am going to just let him carry on a little bit more, but I am going to send the kids out here to shoot around together and then play together. I'm going out. Okay, just be careful. Be back by ten. Hi, Luana. Hi. It's been a long time, hasn't it? <laughs> so, what's happened? Well, I think under like trying to find him, they would have found out that Jonathan had died. I heard about Jonathan. I'm Joy so death. sorry for what happened. It just was so sudden. You know, he just opened up a chest. And that was it. We sit in a row. You go for it, babysitter. You go for it. Well, Len Chen, go for it. You know, Mom and Dad wouldn't want you to suffer alone. You know, you should get out there. See what's around. You know, regardless if you're the oldest of the family, you don't have to shoulder everything on your own. And you're a wolf at the end of the day. You're not meant to be alone. So, I think she'll set him up on a blind date. So, have you tried the app? I had a little bit of a little bit interesting. But how about I set you up with one? I know a few wolves. That you may not know about. Do you think? Sure, stay Do you think that, that would be the best? Well, they'll understand Sacramento. what you're going through. They'll also understand what your kids are going through as well. And then if you have to reintroduce you to someone new, Jonathan was actually very rare. He was, he was a gem. A diamond in the rough. Now, how do we go on a blind date again? Okay. So let's go introduce ourselves. To this. <gasps> oh! Oh well! <laughs> She's decided to be a wolf for it. He, her sister, her sister did warn her that it's a werewolf. Honestly. Right, shall we go? <laughs> Let's speed it along. It's maybe like. She's sad because people keep echoing her, like being like running away from her. But you know, she is a wolf. She is. Oh, your sense to be yours. Hi, I'm. Uh, can I have a table for two? One's a wolf. I hope you don't mind. A what? A wolf. I would say, do you not want to be in your human form? And why would I do that? I'm a wolf. Oh. Oh. Okay, let's have a look at what there is. Mm. I want a mug of dark beer. Oh, it's expensive. But I am a wolf. And where, where's your meat lovingness? Well, I was. Do you not hunt? Because I've only been a wolf. And, you know, I wasn't. I was a dormant wolf. Turned uh, to wolf. So uh, I do like enjoy. My normal, normal food as well. Normal? You know, not, normal. not non meat food. Oh, you mean human food? Well, I am a human. You're a wolf. I'm also human. I can smell it on you, you're a wolf. You should tell me you're a wolf for um, Maybe some other time. Why not? Look! You need to be a bit more. Look, I'm looking for a mate to have ten children with. Ten children? Yes. And just think about it if me and you get together. I heard from your sister when you have seven. Seven kids. 
Then we'll have 10 more. So I make 17 all together. I thought you were talking about like 7 plus, plus 3 makes 10. No, I want lots of children. Well, I'm, I'm not having any more. Well, did you carry or did you? I carried all seven. And, well, my doctor said I shouldn't have any more. Well, you were equipped with a man before this. How many of your pups are actual wolves? Oh, they're all werewolves. Are they all active werewolves? Oh, I don't know. You don't know till the teenagers. You can. You can tan tell. Look, lady. You're just being a bit too much. I need a minute. She's crazy. I should just leave. Okay, okay. Come on. Moana would be very sad. Okay, I have to give this a chance. He's had a minute to breathe. But even if we wanted them to get together, the game said no. Yeah. Yeah, the food came. I started eating without you. Ah, kiss and no, I won't. Oh, he doesn't like it. He'll be like, just eat this and go. Look at this. Humans are so disgusting. Oh, I didn't think you call this wagyu steak. You burnt it. Oh, yeah, you will be. That is an amazing furry suit you're wearing, though. Oh, it looks so long. realistic. I am a wolf! How dare you say I'm wearing a fur suit? Are you going to give me a baby? I'm, I'm, I'm going to be giving you a baby on the first date! You smell tense. What's wrong? Oh. <laughs> You're very, um, oh, wolf. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, you're sweet. Oh, maybe just compliment her. Oh, nice, nice. Nice, nice. Um, so, well, I do hope I get to see you more fun. Um, no, not here, no. Hmm. Maybe not. Do you want to go somewhere more private? No, I think, um, I think I am. Um, I've seen all I need to see. Well, we'll be doing this again then. Girls, no. I will see you no, no. another day. I don't think we'll we, we gel well, Excuse madam. Me? I don't want children. You want children. Uh, good luck in your endeavor. Oh. Goodbye. Excuse me, ma'am. Oh. You will suffer. Goodbye. Don't, don't follow me home. I'm going this yeah. way. My home's this way too. Because <laughs> apparently we're in the same complex. Well, it's right next door uh, to uh, each other. You, you go on ahead. Bye. So that was Letitia. Yes, very forward. Not Wanting lots of kids. Yeah. I want pap. So although he had a nice time getting out, you know, he was maybe like new. <laughs> new. Just a little too much. Even though it's like nearly five in the morning. Well, there's no point I'm going to bed. You can have a nap for you. No point in me going to bed. Right, shall we get this continued? <clears throat> I'll put this cake away first though. I want it to stay fresh. Oh, washing. Hmm. I'll get that after I've practiced a bit. Hmm. I can hear her. I just don't know what one she's in. He can't help your baby too. I don't care. I want to go to sleep. I don't want pants. Go to bed. You're burning fast. I'm amazed no one's complaining. But I'm not going to knock on the door. Hell no. Yes. And. Oh, there's something on there too. Mac and cheese. Oh, that would have been from Moana. Good morning. Good night. Daddy's just going to have a little nap. Good night. Maybe he's going to fix guy. We can't mom. Mom can do it. Mom's sleeping. Leave mom to sleep. Then we can just wake her up. She can fix the doll house. Then she wants. Anything, Brenda. What do you want to do? I don't know, Brenda. Let's call the mom that's around the house. She can Oh. Would you turn that down, sweetheart? No. Thank you. Darn it, why'd you turn off the TV? Mom has sensitive ears. Hey, oh. oh. I'm dying for her. Where are you off 
to John and Virginia. <laughs> Come on over, sis, if you want. Okay, so while we're waiting, then why don't you cook with your four children now? I heard you were mean. I wasn't mean. She was great. What are you talking about? She wanted dead puppies. Dead, but not dead. Dead puppies. Just no. No. I can't. I'm sworn no more children. Well, maybe she's not the one for you then. You can maybe get you with a brother. There's a brother one? No, thank you. He doesn't want pops. Well, that's a bit better. As well as you know, you've been with Jonathan. Maybe he's a better fit. I'll go talk to him. No, you not! Sasta, I know you can't control your temper. But control your temper. You need to give them a chance, you know. Oh, no, no, I have a chance, baby. That is a no-no. Honestly, maybe this city was the worst place for you to move to. Do you think I don't know that? I don't think I don't know that. This is our home. And we will make do with it. Okay. You know, you're always welcome to move back. With seven children? Oh, I do miss the beach. The quiet beach. No. I made my business here. And they wouldn't let me move back anyway. I'm too high. Right, everyone, grab meal, grab your plate. There's only so many. Good one for all of us. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for Bob's woman. She okay? She wants to get mauled by a wolf. You can get better. I'm feeling much better, actually. What did you do? I just mauled someone. What? Who did you mow? I don't know. Blonde. Next door. Todd was bugging me. His wife? I think so. What? You can't do that. I can babysit more if you want. Are you okay? Just my ears. They're in a little pain. I'm sick and tired of that damn blood. Knocking at my door. You're still after him, aren't you? No! I'm not. How would I be after my beautiful wife and child? Okay. No, I keep getting texts from Moana. Yes, so we're going to go on another blind date. Okay, so this is... Oh, yes. Shane! Oh, hi! Hello. You're so tall. <laughs> and you're so short. Shall we get coffee? Mm, okay. Okay, um... Well, first things first, introductions. Introductions. Hello. Um, I'm Sky. <laughs> I guess we'll get introductions out of the way. Clevite, oh, he's enraged. Partiba, oh, no. Oh. So, uh, do you want coffee? Boy, boy. Maybe in a bit. Lunch. But I'm just going to make my intentions clear, right? I, I don't want a serious you relationship. I just want to have fun. I don't want pups. That's my system. Oh, I thought I wanted to get more pups. I have plenty. Yes, I heard you had something like 15 or something like no, that. No, I have seven. Seven? Can you name them all off the top of your head? Yes, I can. There's Garnet, there's Prem, there's Rose, there's Toby, there's Jamie, there's Jonathan Jr. and Bonnie. I see. I bet you were hoping I wouldn't remember them. <laughs> Well, at least you know all the names. But yes, I am not looking for anything other than fun. Well, I'm not really looking for something serious right now myself. I'm just, you know, I was in a long-term relationship. And I'm just getting back to the dating game now. Oh, well, we can just have fun then. You're quite good at this. But yes, although he's angry, they seem to be getting on okay. Well, I play Watch. chess in my spare time. What do you do? Uh, I do washing. Um, 
I work. Your, your eyes are very piercing. Hmm. Oh, well, my eyes, they the glow, I know. That's just the type of wolf I am. Do you want to go to a pub or something? Oh, it's karaoke contest night. Mommy it's karaoke contest night. Do sing, everyone. Really? Do you want to? Ah, oh, not really. No, oh, come on, it'll be fun. Okay, so do we just read from here? Yeah. It'll be fun, come on. At least I'm doing it. No, I'm not that great either. You sound terrible. That's the point though, just have fun. You need to hold the microphone to your birds. It's You want to do another one? No. Nah. Well, he's certainly enjoying himself a bit more than he did with the... Can I have two whiskeys, please? Yes, you never picked up your champagne and strawberries. So someone else took them. And I still have to pay for them? Well, yeah. So, are you... Where have you came from? I've not seen you since I've been here. Oh, we come from... Where is it called? Cave. A cave? Moonwood Mill. A Moonwood moon wood Mill. But we had to have a break from, oh, for God's sake, Christopher. Christopher? An immortal wolf. Asshole. Thinks all werewolves should be friendly. Christopher. Trubain. Trubain brings a bell. The best way to describe him, brown, English. curly hair, oh, huge beard, so wears stupid clothing. He reminds me of an old the teacher of mine. Crint. He did ben teach at one point, and then he stopped for some reason. You know, you're quite nice, compared to your sister. Zamona Oh, she yeah. scared me. Yeah, she can be very forward, honestly. All she wants is pups. That's all she wants. She doesn't want you. She doesn't want anyone. She just wants the pups. She'd use you, abuse you, and kick you out when she has. And I will have to be left to deal with it. Best to avoid them. Yes. Best to. Now. Well, Sky, it's been lovely. But you should maybe head home. Well, what time is it? Coming up for half eleven. So let's try one more flirt. Uh -huh. Try one more. Okay, I'm gonna be bold. Nope, he's not quite feeling it yet. Mm. If you wanna have fun with me, we have to go out a little bit more. Honestly, I've not hanged out with anyone since I've had my kids. And seven of them, one after the other. Pretty much. We had, I had um, three sets of twins. Oh! Ouch! That's a lot! We will see you again! We'll see you again! Bye! Bye! So let's all watch as Garnet blows out our candles. Hi hey everyone! It's Garnet's birthday! Happy birthday my sweetheart! Blow out those candles! So she had to have the uh, sporty one. Yes. Unless you do want to give her a teenage one until she's a bit older. Like we did with Thingy. Yeah. Overachiever, admired icon, drama llama, goal oriented, live fest, teenage rebellion towards independence. Maybe the rebellion one? So Yay! let's have a look. So demand independence, argue with parents, don't go to school three times. Ooh. So I think that could work because then she could go to the gym. Yeah, instead. Instead, and everything. 
So I think that is going to be where we end it off for this episode. So if you've enjoyed it, please leave a like and subscribe. And in the next episode, we will be following Sky on uh, maybe a second date with Shane. Yeah. And we will also now be able to start digging into little Garnet's character. Yeah. And working on the skills that she needs but also ensuring that we get this done yes rebel with a cause so i will probably leave it off with us having a little peek into how she would look but no but thank you for watching and we will see you next time bye for now bye